babies, it's your girl Sharon and I'm back with another video. If you are a new subscriber, welcome to my channel. And if you are a returning subscriber, welcome back. As you can tell by the title of this video, I had asked you guys to actually send me to my Instagram and you guys sent me a couple of them that I have on my phone right now. Some never have I ever statements. I've actually done this video before on my friend Stacey's channel and I decided, hmm, why don't I make one for my channel and let you guys decide what kind of statements I need to confess to. So I took the screenshots from all the never have I ever statements that you sent me on Instagram and I'm gonna do them right here, right now on this channel. I don't even trust you guys. I know how shady and messy you guys can be, but I'll try my best to confess to a couple of them and give you guys a little bit of a backstory on each of the statements that I'm going to be confessing to. So before we get into this video, please do give this video a big thumbs up. Get this video to 2,000 likes. We managed to get a thousand likes on the previous video, which I asked you guys for. So let's get 2,000 likes on this video. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe right now immediately. Click on the post notification button so that you guys can get notifications whenever I post my video. So without further ado, let's get into this video. So in case you guys hear any background noise, don't mind. I'm home chilling with my friends and they don't want to be respectful towards my video and shut up. So I'm just going to go ahead and shoot this video because if I don't do it today, I don't know when I'm going to do it. Here is my poison that I've picked. Uh, some nice cheap wine, Sauvignon Blanc, Durbanville Hills. This was like $50 million. Not that expensive, but cheap wine makes you proper drunk. So let's pour up. Perfect. All right. The first one says, "I never have I ever smoked weed." Hmm. I think everyone has tried smoking weed before, so it's not like a big deal. I'm not a pothead, so no big deal. Never have I ever had a blazer. <laughs> hey. Already, you guys have already started from the beginning of the video. This is just the beginning of the video and you guys are giving me... <laughs> I don't know if I should answer this question, but let me just drink. <laughs> never have I ever had a threesome. No, I actually never had a threesome. I always say this to my friends. I always say that... Okay, some of my friends, or most majority of my friends, have had threesomes before. I have never had a threesome before. Not because I nobody wants to have a threesome with me, but simply because I don't know. It's probably just not my thing. I kind of believe that threesomes are overrated because I heard from other people's experiences. You know, it's like a great fantasy. Everybody wants to have it, but it's a lot of admin work. Like I hear that you have to like switch condoms every single time so i'm not really interested in having a threesome maybe i will in the future but you know right now i'm in a relationship so i'm not looking forward to having a threesome and i would never have a threesome with my boyfriend so excuse me next never have i ever had a crush on a friend or a boyfriend's friend Hmm, I'm gonna skip this one up because I'm gonna look like a shady bitch. Have I ever threw up while giving head? What the hell is that? Like, who gives up? <laughs> who throws up while giving head? No ways. I can never embarrass myself, guys. I'm a certified bad bitch. I cannot. <laughs> 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 never have I ever slept with a married man. Jesu! Never have I ever crushed. <laughs> Your eye, no spicy, spicy, spicy chubby. Never have I ever crushed, crushed on my friend's guy. No, no coach. Kimmy. Never have I ever taken something that wasn't mine without permission. <laughs> Oh my god! Selling me out. I have actually taken stuff without permission, but I have not stolen anything. Money, I've never taken money. Clothes, yeah, I've taken clothes. Stolen food in the pot. Probably stolen a charger or something. I don't know. <laughs> never have I ever 
never dated a drug dealer. I never, I never switched with daddy. daddy. Never. I'm looking for you, daddy. 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 <laughs> no, I have not dated a drug dealer. I like scamming. I like scamming. <laughs> never have I ever given a blowjob, you mean? Of course I have, honey. <laughs> honey, how else would you keep your way? <laughs> never have I ever had an affair with a friend's boyfriend or ex. No. Never have I ever had sex in the toilet in a club. No. Never have I ever had sex in the car. Of course I have, actually. Um, I've had sex in a car once before, but only because I wanted to try it, you know, because I've never tried it before. So, I had a boyfriend for like two months. <laughs> he was very timid and shy. He was not really like wild, a wild type of guy. So like one day he came to, um, I think he came to see me. I was hanging out with my friends at a specific hotel um they have like a you know a rooftop bar or whatever you call it so he was just coming to check me out coming to see if i'm having a good time with my friends and then of course with me coming to see him i felt like he really just wanted me to go home with him and i was like you know i'm still having fun with my friends so let's drive to the parking lot real quick <laughs> Never have I ever had sex with someone 15 years older than me. Jesus is love! 15? How much is 15? 15. 15 is a lot. No. Maybe I have. I don't know. I never have I ever kissed a girl. Like lesbian vibes. I'm not a lesbian. I don't do no Gucci. I'm strictly dickly. I've kissed girls before. I've kissed my friends. But... If it has to go anywhere further than just kissing, it's just not my type of thing. No offense to the LGBTQ community, I fucked with you guys. Never have I ever been sexual with a girl. So, going back to what I just said about me not being into women like that, I've never been into women in my life. But truth be told, obviously with um, so many people speaking on um, girl on girl action, in their experiences, I obviously would like to experience these things. Like I'm very curious about this thing. There was this one time I was hanging out with you know some friends and then no chilling with this lady. She was really sweet, she was really nice. We were talking about free sounds basically. Adult conversations that people always have when they're drinking. So we were talking about free sounds and then we spoke about um, having sex girl on girl and I said I never had sex with a girl before this girl offered to show me or give me my first experience right but I hated it I really didn't like it I don't know if it's just her that didn't know how to do it or is this just not my thing or it's just a horrible experience I obviously told some of my friends about it and they were like nah you just need the right person to show you how to do the right thing, hit the right spots. She was doing all the things, but I wasn't doing anything. I was just chilling. Like, I was just like, okay, girl, okay, girl. This girl offered to show me or give me my first experience, right? But I hated it. I really didn't like it. I don't know if it's just her that didn't know how to do it, or this is just not my thing, or it's just a horrible experience. Obviously told some of my friends about it, and they were like, nah, you just need the right person to show you how it's done. Do the right thing, hit the right spots. She was doing all the things, but I wasn't doing anything. I was just chilling, like, I was just like, okay, girl, okay, girl. Today. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to click on the post notification button so that you can get notifications every time I post a video. That's it from me today. See you in my next video.